clearing the memory on a Garmin Nuvi. I'm going to do it with two of them here. If you just bought a Nuvi, it probably came from somewhere not local to you, which means it's got old location data in it. Or if you notice that your Nuvi is running a bit sluggish, clearing the memory might, might help out. I don't say it will, I say it might. Right. This may or may not delete the favorites, so if you have any, back them up first. Also, uh, this is a system reset, a version of it, but I effectively call this a super reset because it clears out the uh, non-volatile RAM, which you will see in a moment. It doesn't delete the map. I don't believe it clears out the travel history. That's separate. But what this does is that it gives all the memory back to the newbie as if it were brand new. So we're going to start with an old guy here, Nuvi 40, and what we do is we just power this guy up and then go into the developer info and clear out that RAM as soon as it gets here. All right, go to volume and then just press and hold the top right corner. You gotta wait. Actually, I don't know if this one does it from the top. No, this one does it from the speedometer. I'm sorry. We will go from the speedometer. Okay, it's blank right now because it's getting a signal. It's no big deal. Just press and hold the center. There we go. And we go to developer info, and then right here, non-vol available. Oop, wrong spot. Now I can clear the non-vol here, and you'll notice it shows the size in use and such, and whatever, how many entries, the defrag count, you just clear. Are you sure? Yeah. And again, this, it, right now, it just reset itself. So now it's going to act as if it were brand new and it's going to prompt for country selection and so on. Oh, I should also note something here. When you do this, it will take a long time for it to reacquire a GPS signal on first boot, but then after that you should be fine. Yep, United States, English, okay, that's it, okay, so I'm going to power this guy off, and now we'll do it with a 2457, if you have a 2597 or a um, 2689, um, most drive smarts, they will act like this one. So, okay, same deal. This one I know I can go to volume and just press and hold the top right corner until this. Now, there is clear all user data. It's not the same because it does not clear out the memory. So, developer info again, non-vol statistics, same screen as before like on the older one. Tap the hamburger and clear. Same deal with this one, it's going to reboot itself, it'll take a second, it's clearing its memory right now, and there it goes. Same deal, it's going to prompt for country selection, just as if it were brand new. It does take a moment. United States, English, agree. Right. Let me just put this into simulator because I know it's going to give me an error because I'm indoors right now. Yes, I know. See, it's giving those prompt notices because it thinks, you know, oh, it's brand new now. No, not brand new. Just reset. So again, uh, this will effectively perform a super reset on this. 
And if you just got yourself a used Nuvi or Drive Smart or something like that, clearing the memory is suggested. Again, it does not delete any map data. It might delete favorites, might not. The most important thing is that you get it gives it back all its memory to start fresh, so to speak. And if you do encounter any sluggish issues with this thing calculating routes or recalculating, it might, again, I won't say it will, but it might speed it up a little bit, a little bit, so it at least gets back to the way it was. So that's it. See ya.